When it comes to celebrity marriages, there are a few phases that are all too common. There's the dating phase that comes before the marriage that gets people to ask if the couple will be serious or if it's just a fling. Then there's the actual marriage and how it'll impact both their lives and their careers. And then if things go sour, there's the aftermath of the divorce. That's where people wonder just how things will go for both sides and how quickly they'll be able to move on from the situation. For Kim Kardashian and Kanye West, their divorce has dominated headlines over the last six months, and now one of them has moved on, and it's Kanye. Allow us to break it down for you, but before we do that, go ahead and do me a favor, leave a like on this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon so you never miss an upload from us. And with that being said, let's get straight into the video. Do you want to win an iPhone 12, maybe a MacBook Pro? How about $500 cash? All you have to do is comment the secret hidden message somewhere in this video. That's it. Oh, and leave a like on this video and subscribe to the channel so we can keep affording these giveaways. Winner will be announced at the last day of each month. Thanks for watching and good luck. Number four, Kanye causing the divorce and reacting to it. Obviously, there were a lot of people who were wondering what just happened between Kim and Kanye to lead to their divorce. In short, it was a lot but the information was honestly rather conflicting based on who you talked to. From Kim wanting out, to Kanye wanting out, to potential affairs that were debunked, to Kanye wanting to move the family to either Wyoming or the desert, for real. After turning 40 this year, I realized like, no, I don't want a husband that lives in a completely different state. Yeah. To me, I thought, oh my God, that's when we're getting along the best. It was a lot to try and sort through. Then when the divorce happened, there were lots of rumors and reports about how the two were reacting to everything, especially with Kanye. Kanye has been trying to throw himself into work the past few weeks, but it's been hard to stay focused with the split weighing on him. An insider told Us Weekly on February 19th. Although the Yeezy designer knew it was coming, it still hasn't been easy. He's been distant and unresponsive as he processes everything that's going on. The source added, Kim was always Kanye's dream girl, even before they got together. So the thought of her not being his wife anymore is a lot to take in, whether it's the best decision for their family or not. A very interesting statement, one that was kind of counteracted by another saying that not only was the divorce known by the two in terms of it happening for a long time, but that they're getting along great. Kim and Kanye are getting along, a source told People Magazine. Kim Kardashian reveals the moment she knew she wanted a divorce from Kanye West. I didn't come this far just to come this far and not be happy. It all went down on the scene. They both stayed true to their commitment to make the best situation for the kids. Kim is very happy that they've managed to keep things calm. She thinks Kanye is a good dad. The insider continued, she wants him to be able to spend as much time with the kids as he wants. For every week that goes by since she filed for divorce, Kim seems happier. The source said, she knows that filing for divorce was the right decision. The kids are doing as good as she could hope. During a chat between the KKW beauty founder and her mom, Kris Jenner. Kim got candid about her life with the rapper, which has been split in recent years between their California home and- Which is certainly one side of the story, but another said that Kanye was the one who initiated all of it. An insider explained that the rapper is super annoyed that the story is being constantly presented as her divorcing him, when actually it was him saying for a year that they have nothing in common except the kids and he wanted out. She pulled all the stops to try to save the marriage. I never thought I was lonely and I never, I always thought that's totally fine. I could just have my kids. My husband moves from state to state and yeah. I just, I'm on this ride with him. And while Kardashian was the first to take the formal legal steps to end the relationship, the source adds that's because West wanted to let her file first in order to give her dignity. So yeah, that happened apparently. But fast forward to now and things have apparently gotten really good for Kanye because he has a new girlfriend. Number three, Arena. It's on. Yup, ET has learned Kanye West and Arena Shake are an item, at least casually. With the source telling ET, Kanye has been trying to woo Arena. So you might be a little jarred by that, but it's true. Her name is Arena Shake and the two are officially an item. Though how you quantify item will honestly depend on who you're talking to. They've also known each other professionally for years. He started pursuing her a few weeks ago. Kanye is a persuasive guy, a source tells People, adding that they stayed three nights at Villa Lacoste in Paris. He hung out with her in NYC before they celebrated his birthday in France. She seemed smitten. He invited her to France and she happily accepted. With the source telling ET, Kanye has been trying to woo Arena and impress her. 
Our source says the rapper and the supermodel are spending time together and it's casual. The, the source adds of the 35 year old Russian supermodel. They are not officially dating, but there is an interest from both sides. A second insider tells people that the new couple met a while back when they crossed paths in the fashion industry. Shake previously modeled for Yeezy and appeared in his music video for Power. West also name dropped her in Christian Dior flow with the lyric, I want to see Arena Shake next to Doubtson back in 2010. So you know that Kanye is serious about someone in some context if he's willing to sing about them. Celebrating the rapper's 44th birthday. Yeezy was wearing all black with a gold chain necklace, while Arena sported a white crop top and baggy black pants. After all, singing is very special to Kanye. Now, some may say that this is way too soon, as the divorce isn't fully official yet, as things are still being worked out, like custody, ownership of certain items and property, and so on. But if you really think about it, they've been done for a while now. So it's fair for them to be seeing other people, or at the very least approaching potential new flames as the final details are being sorted out. As for what drew them to one another, the source says, quote, Kanye and Arena have known each other for years through the entertainment and fashion industry, and he has always thought she was extremely beautiful and cool. Plus, Kim already has plenty of rumors going on about who she's dating. So yeah, Kanye is breaking no laws here. Number two, when Kanye got with Arena, rumors of a romance between the supermodel 35 and Bound 2 rapper 44 first swirled last month. In photos published by the Daily Mail, the duo were spotted together in France, possibly celebrating the Yeezy designer's Tuesday, June 8th birthday. Arena and Kanye have been spending time together and getting to know one another. The source also adds they're having a good time together, and Kanye really likes that Arena is low-key and private. The source adds, he always thought she was beautiful, and they're both looking forward to seeing where this goes. Oh, and here's another thing. While one source says they aren't dating, Another says that they are. Kanye and Arena are dating, a source tells us exclusively. They've been quietly seeing each other for a couple of months. Another interesting element here is that Arena is in no way tied to Kim K. Arena isn't friends with Kim at all, so there's no weirdness there, adds the second insider. Most would think, why does that matter? Well, many know that Kanye West most definitely has a vengeful side, and because of that, it would have been very easy for certain mental faculties to use that persuasion to get close to a friend of Kim K's and use it against her. A source previously told ET that she feels very fortunate and isn't too focused on Kanye's dating life or rumors about him right now, but adds that the situation between Kim and Kanye is still pretty emotional. But clearly that isn't what happened and it further shows that there wasn't any malice in the breakup between Kim and Kanye, despite what many have reported, which was enforced ironically by Kim K herself, because on Kanye's birthday she posted, happy birthday. Kardashian wrote on Instagram, posting a photo of herself with West and several of their children love you for life. Now to be clear, this social media post was done before it was revealed that he and Arena were dating, so she hasn't officially posted anything on how she feels on the matter. But things could change quickly, or perhaps she already knew. You never know. She even spoke on the divorce recently and noted something key. I just think he deserves someone who will support his every move and go follow him all over the place. We deserve Thanks. someone that can go support his every move yeah. and go follow him all over the place and move to Wyoming. I can't do that. He should have a wife that supports his every move and travels with him and does everything. The KKW beauty mogul said during the June 3rd episode of Keeping Up With The Kardashians, I can't do that. A fair thing to say given all that Kanye is and has done in the past, and that might be the biggest thing that decides if this potential relationship succeeds between Kanye and Arena. Can she follow him everywhere? Number one, life with Kanye. There are many people who have wondered just what Kanye's life would be like without Kim K in it, and honestly, we're about to find out in a big way. Many felt it was a miracle that these two not only lasted seven years, but had multiple kids together. I feel like a f***ing failure, that it's like a third f***ing marriage. Yeah, I feel like a loser but i can't even think about that like i want to be happy whether arena can tolerate all that kanye does in terms of his bipolar disorder and more remains to be seen it will be a test and trial no doubt but if this new relationship proves nothing else it's that kanye is well and truly ready and willing to move on from kim k and live his life without her and there you have it everyone a look at how kanye has gone from his separation with kim kardashian to apparently dating a supermodel were you surprised by how quickly kanye bounced back from the fallout of his marriage? Did you expect Kim to be the first one to go and do a romance with someone? How long do you think this relationship will last? Go ahead and let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Be sure to subscribe and I'll see you next time on the channel.